but I like just to keep grounded and down to earth. And I'll tell you what I like to do. I like to fucking train my balls off every single day, knowing that nobody else is doing it. I like running up early in the mornings and late at night. I like putting the work in. Even though I, I, I'm dressing in silk pyjamas, and I don't have to go out like the old fighters used to say, it's easy to get up when you're broke or when you've got money, or when you're in your silk pyjamas, you don't want to get out of bed. I just do more than I've ever done. I sacrifice more today than I did when I was absolutely starting off with nothing from the bottom. And I don't know even how that's possible. I, I'm, I'm, I'm tighter today, now I've made it, than I ever was coming up. Hmm. I'm more stricter, more dedicated, train more, smarter, train smarter. But I, <clears throat> before it was like, it's this dream job to be heavyweight champion of the world and all of the, the shit that comes with it. But when you get there to the top, you find out that the real only thing that matters is, is your training, is, is your boxing, is your fights, and all the other bullshit that comes along with it. The fame, the glory, the credit. The, the articles, the the money, the, whatever you can buy with the money, it's all short-lived crap. Because at the end of the day, you're only as good as your last tenor. And that's, that's all she wrote. And you know, when it's all over, no motherfucker wants to know. You're just another prick with money. And that's all you'll ever be. Another bare bum in the shower. And everybody loves a winner. But no motherfucker loves a loser. And they all jump off their dick when he's lost. Look at AJ. He had everybody on his dick. He's had two defeats and now nobody's on it. Excuse my French. Um, everybody loves a winner. Deontay Wilder was some sort of folk hero. Now he's just a big dosser. And, you know, everybody, you're only as good as your last fight. That's a fact. No matter how many fights you win in your life, you're only remembered for your final loss. And that's all she wrote. 